you know, several minutes sometimes to uh, to uh, to recover and kind of work your way back in the game. I was curious for a guy who's in his third year, how much have you noticed that on the court when situations like that are unfolding? I notice it a lot, um, especially um, this year because we have a lot of more younger guys. So they really, they really don't like know. They get down on themselves a lot, and it's kind of hard to to lift them up at times because they just taking a, they just playing awful or anything like that. But it's just, a, it's just the spurts of the games that we have to pick each other up more. This and that. What do you say to uh, to some of the uh, to some of the younger guys in in the moments like that where you can tell that they need some help? Uh, like, like I tell them, I just tell them all, all the time, it's, it's your first college game. It's, it's going to be a lot of jitters. Um, we've been through that at uh, the same time. Just in that day, it's just basketball. Like, just play play your game. Like, it's not not too much to think about. Just play your game. Uh, I try to lift them up every time. I make it, if miss a shot, air ball, whatever. Just shoot, keep shooting the ball. I just keep playing. Uh, Deese, what do you feel like wasn't working with the defense, especially in the first half? Um, we came out, we came out sluggish. Uh, it wasn't aggressive like it usually, uh, as opposed to at the tip, we should just, we got hit in the mouth before they hit us in the mouth. They gave us our own blood. So that we, that's what we didn't do as a, as a team. Where do you feel like that a lack of energy came from? What do you feel like caused that? Um, it was really, was just, I guess the newer, newer guys, they, they expected, they were expecting a lot of fans and this and that to ha- have a lot of more energy. Uh, and that's that's most that's most definitely was the the biggest problem for us. We didn't we didn't carry that same energy over that we had like we usually have in the, uh, the atmosphere of the arena. So we had we struggled with that. These seemed like you know they came out in the zone defense and you guys kind of played into their hands by shooting so much from the perimeter. Was that a game plan or did they kind of get you into a, a three shooting contest that maybe you didn't want to because of your size advantage? Oh, no, we uh, we just like coach said, take our shots. Uh, that's what that was the game plan. Just take our shots when they in the zone. Any team in the zone, just take our shots. Uh, and most most definitely was the the key was to get the ball into the in the paint as much as we can. Uh, I wanted to ask you real quick just about uh, your impressions of some of the freshmen. Uh, did any of them stand out? And in, in particular, <coughs> guy seemed like he had a good game was William Jeffers. Uh, he, that's that's. Uh, I was just gonna say that uh, you know, he gave us a he gave us a lift of momentum when he came in and he started playing good. I told him as soon as he got in the game, I was like, take your shots, don't don't hesitate, and this and that. Because uh, a couple of practice, I mean, last practice he was kind of timid, like not shooting. I was like, man, shoot the ball, man. Like you can shoot, shoot the ball, and that's what he did. And he he stepped up to the plate tonight. I just, well, we talked with uh, Coach Capel a little bit earlier. He was, um, you know, he had said that in practice, he, you know, he said that he'd seen good moments from his team, bad moments. Um, what for you guys? What do you all? What do you all struggle with the most in those bad moments? That is communication. Lack of communication. That's that's the biggest key for us. When things not going right, we just stop talking to each other, and we thinking that's going to solve anything, but it's not. And that showed tonight as well. Uh, like Coach been saying, like you got to communicate through whatever. You don't know you don't know nothing until you communicate and you talk to each other. So that's the biggest happy.